Hey guys, Uncle Dave coming at you. Beautiful quest to college. Once again, with me, my wonderful technical assistant, none other than Jackson Howe. We've been munching on chick mix right here, because we're hungry. I wish I had a beer, but I'd probably get fired. And he's too young also. So Jackson now thinks he can beat me in basketball. I'm thinking that there's no chance. Come here, Jackson. There's no chance he can beat me in basketball. Because you know what I do to him? I cross him over. I back him down. I got you. got no chance against me. Get out of here, Paul. Yeah, I break his ankles every day. Get out of here. All right, so your next exercise is on uh, temperature exercise. Another 10-pointer. Another I don't think this one will be too bad, unless you hate math. Now, you can't hate math. It's not that hard. Take a deep breath, right? If you're old enough, have a beer if you're so inclined. If not, just deep breaths, no math anxiety. We're going to get through this. All right, we're doing uh, Fahrenheit to Celsius, Celsius to Fahrenheit conversions. I'm going to give you an example. I'm going to do number one first, number one A, it looks like, on the exercise over there. So this is how you do um, the conversion. Fahrenheit equals 1.8C plus 32. So I'm going to say, let's say that it's 15 degrees Celsius. Um, what would it be on the Fahrenheit scale? So you go 15 times 1 times 1.8, that gives us 27, then you simply add 32 to that. So the answer on this one is 59 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, on number 2, 2A, I believe that one is asking 95 degrees Fahrenheit, what would that be on a Celsius scale? This is the formula, Celsius equals Fahrenheit minus 32 divided by 1.8. So, 95 minus 32 is 63, and then you divide it by 1.8, and the answer is 35. So, when you guys do these, please show your work. Okay, the last couple questions, number 3 and 4, are a little bit different. To solve this, you need to know that 1 degree Celsius, let me go to the other side, 1 degree Celsius equals 1.8 degrees Fahrenheit. So, I'm going to give you an example. They're not the same ones that are on there, but you do them just the same way. Example I'm giving you says, let's say the temperature went up on any given day, 10 degrees Celsius. How much would that have been on the Fahrenheit scale? Since 1 degree Celsius is 1.8 Fahrenheit, you would just multiply 10 times 1.8. It would have gone up 18 degrees on the Fahrenheit scale. On a different day, the temperature went down 12 degrees on a Fahrenheit scale. How much did it go down on a Celsius scale? A little more difficult. Um, this is a long way to do it. You set up a ratio, 1.8 over 12 equals 1 over x. So if you cross multiply, 18x equals 12, isolate the variable, divide by 1.8. 12 by 1.8 equals 6.7. So it went down 6.7 degrees on this Celsius scale. You want the shortcut? Don Rose would be mad at me, right? My math buddy for showing you shortcuts. On the first one, you multiply the number by 1.8. On the second one, number four, which is on your exercise, you divide by 1.8. With that said, that's a very short one. Fill this out, show your work for me, show, you how you did, show me how you did your math, take a photo, submit it to me as a Word Docs again, and I will talk to you guys soon. See ya.